Monday, December 6th. And you might be asking me, Kim, why do you look so tired? Um, well, I'll answer that. It's because I am really tired. I'm just so tired. Just got back, it's around 7 a.m. Just got back from dropping Brooke off at school. Um, I'm gonna make some coffee. I need all the coffee today, like straight into my veins. Um, I think I'm gonna use new Christmas mugs that I got from my white elephant gift from our party. I made sure and stole some Christmas mugs. Um, and I'll get, I'm gonna open some advents and kind of do a little bit of knitting and hopefully relax, hopefully relax a little bit before I have to start work. Um, I started, which I didn't show in the yesterday's vlogs. I did it after I was uploading the video. I started the Fiber Tales, um, Fiber Tales. <laughs> I started the Arabian Tales blanket and I'm like stuck on the very last, cause you end up having both the whole fox face, according to Holly, you have both of those kind of on your needle still at the end and then you bind them all off together. And I'm kind of stuck on how I'm doing that. Like on the instructions. Anyways, I tried it once and it did not do, it did not look right. So I need to look at it again. Hopefully I was kind of tired last night and I was trying to do it. Maybe if I look at it this morning when I'm extra tired, that might help. <laughs> Maybe I can find a video or something. We'll see. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and make some coffee, open some advents, and I'll show you what I'm doing with my Arabian Tales blanket and then I'll have work for the day. <laughs> to the grocery store across the street because it's like, a, you can actually can't drive into the parking lot at their high school. They have it all shut off for the buses and the kids leaving. So you just have to like go somewhere else. So they all just walk across the street at the crosswalk and all of his parents come over to the, the grocery store and wait in the parking lot. So I'm just here waiting for Brooke to get um, over here so we can go home. And I'm working on Damon's socks. I haven't showed these in a while because Poor Damon, I put off his stuff before I put off anybody else's. Here's the sock, this is the first, it's supposed to be his Christmas pair that he just told me about he wanted. I'm making, I made them extra long because he wants to wear them underneath his suits. I just started the Fish Lips Kiss Heel and it's like a smoky, it's, what's, it's described as a smoky navy blue. And these are gonna be really great, I think. So I'm just starting the heel on the first sock. I don't know, I, my, my new goal, because I have other stuff to get done, gift knitting, is that I want at least this this single sock done so that I can wrap it up 
and be like, here's your sock pair, but only one so far and I'll get the other one done. And he'll be okay with that because he's sweet. Um, and then I'll go ahead and hopefully be almost done with the second one. This is my new goal to not be stressed. <laughs> Finish this sock by Christmas. I totally can. I'm just doing like, you know, 2 billion other socks and projects. But um, yeah, and I haven't been reaching for it because it's a really easy pattern. It's just because I have, I have to kind of pay attention because the heel, so I can't do it. I have to look. So if I'm anywhere where I'm trying to knit while not looking at my knitting, I can't really do that because, you know, there's some certain stitches I have to look at, but I can probably get the heel done today and then I just can keep knitting on it. So anyways, just working on it right now, waiting for Brooke. I've figured out the Arabian Tales blanket. I'm so excited. It's so cool. It's even cooler than I thought and it's actually more fun than I thought it'd be. I thought it'd be really hard and kind of intricate and it would take too long, but the little fox faces or mermaid tins are not taking as long as I thought. So anyways, um, I'll show you more later. Uh, <laughs> All right, we just got our what, Brooke? Our yarnable box. I mean, my yarnable, but it's always... My yarnable. <laughs> and Brooke always guesses, right, Brooke? Okay. okay. But, ooh, there's some good stuff in here. Okay, I'm gonna, I give her, oops. <laughs> I give her the, information card the no name i give you the name of the colorway and you have to it's guess the color it's stupid doesn't do anything because don't. all right the name for december 2021 is grape crush <laughs> see see his thing you would think it'd be purple right it's probably not gonna be purple is brought to you by sugar plum fairies fresh snow and twinkle lights i hope it's purple i'm really excited about it purple pink and white. Purple, pink, and white. What do you think it's mostly? What's the what's the most color? Purple, like a like a like a um. What's that one color? I'm trying to think. I mean, <laughs> purple. No, it's, it's so with an M. Mar maroon. No, not mauve? maroon. No, not mauve. Okay, I'm learning. I'm running out of M. Okay, never mind. No. An M color? It's in Minecraft. Okay. It's, it's like a, it's like a purplish pink. Magenta? Magenta. <laughs> <laughs> All right, are we ready? You want to pull it out? That's kind of what you were saying, right? Didn't you say mm -hmm. that? Yeah. There's no white, though. What, um, the you didn't say what do you mean there's no white? Do you not see that little streak you right have there? You to hold it up. I can't see. Do you not see that streak of white right there? That one streak of white? Yeah. Okay. But that's pretty. Show the camera, Brooke. Do your job. You're sweeping and chickadee job. Good job. That's really pretty. It's not very Christmassy. It's but pretty. it's probably not meant to be Christmassy, obviously. I love it. It's so pretty. Those are my colors right there. All right, what else did we get, Brooke? Oh, read the fun fact. The month of December originally had 30 days. Around 700 BCE, the month dropped to 29 days. When the Julian calendar was adopted, two days were added, taking month to 31 days. Nice. Okay, what are the extras? Read off the extras. Um, a sip stitch enamel 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 pin from one. Chani P's Corner. You want to show it? Ooh, that's cool. I like that. A sip sip knit stainless steel straw set. Ooh, what's this? That's cool. A class cling beverage markers designed by Yarnable. That's her name. Because there's some capital letters and some not. <laughs> All right, show it. What's it say? It says drink and knit things. Oh, that's cool. That's a bunch in there. Yeah. Drink and knit things. I like it. All right, awesome. Cool. Good job, Breck. <laughs> so the kitchen is clean. Yay. In case anyone was concerned about that. <laughs> but that took literally took me two hours of cleaning the kitchen. Uh, Brooke had a rough day, so I let her do her normal chores and not help me. I, I was feeling really nice. Um, I'm going to, it's, what time is it? 5.48. Damon's on work trip. Brooke and I are just going to have leftovers from the party. We still have tons uh, for dinner. And I'm going to go upstairs and now I'm going to go relax knowing that my kitchen's clean and smells nice and work on some more knitting. I'm so excited. I'm going to go upstairs and show you guys all of my new stuff. Um, I cast on Merrily, which I showed you a little bit last night. It is so Pretty. Rebecca from Raging Pro Wind. Oh my gosh, she's amazing. Amazing at shawls, especially DK weight shawls. I also made her vintage tea shop shawl in DK. I mean, it's amazing. It's they're, they're really fun to knit. They're easy, yet they look intricate. I mean, but it's always something new. 
I just love it, constantly switching. Amazing. My Arabian Tales blanket, oh my gosh, so fun. Um, what else do I have left to cast on? Oh, I still need to cast on my Zebra Yarns Advent Swap, which is um, hmm, Litmus Cowl. I'm like kind of, wait, that might be like my after, like when all my other Advents are done, but I keep my Advent fun going, I'll do that one. Um, and I'm doing my Just Feel Cozy Wrap. Love that, it's so fun to knit that, or crochet that too, and it's so cozy, I can't wait to have it. Um, the yarn is amazing by Rising Tide Fiber Co. Love it all. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go upstairs and I'm gonna try not to just work on my advent. I need to also work on my gift knitting and get those kind of done. London shawl, my niece's shawl, the um, buffalo plaid one, only needs like two more repeats, which is like 20 rows, but so close. So I need to, I want to get that done by this weekend, so then I can start my sister's infinity cowl in the same kind of pattern. So I'm gonna go upstairs and show you guys what I got. I'm gonna make some more mold wine um, that was brought to us at the party and let them, um, we like mold wine. So it is really delicious. And I'm gonna go ahead and warm up some more, go upstairs and relax, do some knitting, and I'll show you guys what's, uh, what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. 